Hey there internet, Mitchell here at Redwater Dodge, home of the $10 oil change and rig ready Rams. Today we are going to be looking at one of our newest trucks. It is a 2020 Ram 1500 Rebel in the billet metallic color. On the back of the truck here you see it has the black bumper with the Rebel package. You also have the black Ram logo across the tailgate there and as well as the Rebel and the 4x4 logos are also black. Spray and bed liner with the uh, bed utility group. So you got the little bars on the side there you can strap stuff to as well as the LED lighting inside of the box. So if you put a tunnel cover on it, you can have lighting inside of it. It also has the uh, sport style dual exhaust and the uh, front and rear park sensors. Class 4 hitch receiver with the 4 and 7 pin trailer wiring connectors. It also has the LED license plate lights there as well. This truck actually has the uh, bed step in it as well. So it makes it pretty easy to get up into there. You also have the uh, 18 inch uh, Rebel rims wrapped in the Goodyear Duratrax. Very good tire. Rebels come with these flat black uh, fender flares on them as well. You also have the uh, push to open fuel door with the capless fueling, which is pretty awesome. This truck has the shorter of the two available bed options on it, so uh, it's a little bit shorter. Looks a little bit better in my opinion. You also have the uh, pink match door handles on it there. This truck has the really faux mirrors as well as the uh, blind spot monitoring system in it. It has the rebel hood on it obviously so you get the two uh, louvers here in the front we'll open this up and take a look inside it has the 5.7 liter hemi making 395 horsepower and 410 foot pounds of torque close this it has, you see it has the rebel grill there obviously but uh, it looks very sharp you also have the uh, as previously mentioned the front park sensors there and the tow hooks led headlights led fog lights very bright very nice if you look on the passenger side of the vehicle you can see that it doesn't have an antenna on it because they shaved them off in the new body style, so it makes them look a little bit uh, look a little bit sharper. We'll, we'll go inside and check it out. So, guys, now that we are inside of the truck here, you can see that it has the premium uh, leather seating here with the nice perforations for your AC seat feature. The Rebels also have the uh, Rebel logo there embossed in the side of the seat, so that's super awesome. Uh, leather wrap center console with the uh, contrast stitching with the red and white to go with the uh, red accents here in the interior. You also have the embossed Ram head in there. Flip up the top portion of the center console and you have a ton of storage as well as a USB port. Close it up and go down one more level and you have a ton of storage in here as well as a little flip up divider you can flip up so stuff doesn't come flying from the front into the back. It keeps it a little bit separated. It also has a max fill line so you know how high you can fill it and still have the function of your sliding center console portion. Uh, chain storage as well as a nice little dish there. It's also removable with this little tab you pull up and there you go. Uh, cup holders there as well. Down here you have the uh, three-prong plug, so you can plug a charger into it and uh, charge your phone. Speaking of phone, you have a phone holder there. Uh, USB, USB-C, and auxiliary ports are all here up in the front. You can turn your front and rear park sense off with the push of a button there, so if you're pulling into your garage, you can click your uh, front one off, and it won't yell at you when you get close to the wall. And if you're pulling a trailer, you can click the rear one off, and it won't yell at you when you're backing up your trailer. Uh, trailer brake controller is here as well, with the uh, gain settings there on top. This one has the 8.4 inch touch screen in it, so you have the actual analog dials here for your heater controls and your fan speed and your heated seats, obviously, and your volume. But uh, going to the screen here, you can see the backup camera incredibly clear. It also has a zoom feature so you can look at your trailer ball and have a little bit more of a uh, reference for when you're hooking up your trailer. They also come with a free year of the Sirius XM. After that year, you'll have to subscribe, but they do give you the opportunity to see if you do like it and. Uh, you have to subscribe. Uh, this truck also has the nav in it, which is pretty cool. A lot of people like that. Uh, heated seats, heated wheel, back to your backup camera if you wanted to. Uh, you can also click the screen off, so if you're driving at night, it isn't blinding you. Uh, coming down here, you have your rear axle lock as well as your downhill uh, descent control, and your uh, eight speed automatic has the dial shifter, so you get your park reverse and neutral drive. Also has two wheel drive, four high and four low. On the steering wheel here on the left hand side you have your gauge cluster controls as well as your hands-free phone controls and then on the right hand side here you have your cruise control settings and your gear limiter switch so if you're pulling a trailer and you're trying to take a hill you lock it in a certain gear and it will take that hill a little bit easier uh, down here beside your uh, left knee i guess you have your uh, adjustable pedals and your parking brake as well as your headlight controls uh, power up power mirrors which are pretty cool uh, the truck also has a panoramic sunroof which is a pretty big option that I should have touched on a little bit earlier, but uh, it is very nice. It stops halfway there, so you can have the function of a normal sunroof, or you can slide it all the way back. 
and it does provide a natural a lot of natural lighting into the vehicle it has a power sliding rear window as well which is pretty sweet you can also open this portion of the sunroof pretty big pretty cool you also have the assist and sos uh, feature which is much like chevy's onstar but uh better because it's ram obviously uh, uh universal garage door opener up here as well in the uh sunshade also has a uh, sunglasses holder there as well up here they have redesigned this so it's a little bit bigger as well as it has the 12 volt plug this truck also has the alpine stereo system in it so it is the upgraded uh stereo a little bit more bass out of it uh, we'll go into the back and we'll check it out so guys now that we're in the back seat of the truck here you can see that they carry through with the uh, very nice leather seats along with the uh, contrast stitching and the perforations you also have the flip down center console here with the two cup holders in it very nice if you're sitting back here provides a little bit of a armrest there flip the seat up tons of storage you can also flip this little partition down and gives you a little bit more under the seat storage or you can flip it up and you get a little bit of a bigger flat load surface because they got rid of the transmission tunnel in these trucks so it is massive and flat uh, you have the usb usb c ports there as well as the three prong plug you can plug a charging port into they also have this nice like checker plate almost uh stuff all over in here and the red trim to go with the rebel package uh tons of behind the seat storage as well this truck also has the uh, ram all-weather floor mats in it which are pretty cool you can also cut these little part uh holes out here you see the little cutting cutting spot here and then you can act, have access to your uh, tie down points as well you also have the ram bin in this truck with the removable liner that you can take out and clean so if you put stuff in there like i don't know ice uh you can pull it out dump it out and it's uh, a little bit easier to clean uh, previously mentioned, the Alpine stereo system gives you these speakers up here, as well as the uh, has an airbag that comes down and covers the back window, rear sliding window, has mics back here for the uh, hands-free phone control. So guys, if you're interested in this 2020 Rebel, you can email us at sales at Redwater Dodge, call us 780-942-3629, or better yet, you can come on in.